down our family resource wing right here. Every student on here is either in the program, has been through the program. That was tricky. Hi. Welcome back. Hello, good morning. I was watching a lot of you this morning <laughs> as I woke up at 5 o'clock this morning and I must say I'm very, very impressed. You don't, do you know who I'm talking to yet? Do you know who this is? This is, <laughs> this is number eight for the Cleveland Browns. His name is Mr. Jarvis Landry. Can we get him up? This is our family resource room. Vic, you're in here. Yes, I am. Come get our special guest. Hello, special guest. Good, how are you? So last week, or the week before, our team was out traveling, and Vicki was here, and one of the moms of the school came into this room right here, and she had black and blue eyes. She had a huge pair of sunglasses to hide it. Um, she had marks, I think, throughout her body, and she came in this room to tell Vicki right there um, what was going on at home and can you help me. So before she went anywhere else in the community, she came right here to the I Promise School. And then Miss Vicki yes. took her to the, the courthouse and made sure that, in the police department, and made sure everything was there to keep her family safe. What grade is this? Fourth grade. Fourth grade. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. Yep, yep. How you doing? Everybody good? Yeah. yeah. They are so excited, they're speechless. <laughs> this is our happy, happy room. And we stock this with all kinds of coats, hoodies, hats. Say a family comes in to Miss Vicki, who you met earlier, and they're freezing and they don't have hats, gloves. They can come and pull all kinds of things as they need them. Basically, the room is exactly what it sounds like it is. Nobody leaves don't worry here about unhappy ever. No, about it. Right. Mm -hmm. no it's, it's a realization of LeBron's dream. If he were in school, he said that he would be at this school. He would be a student in our school. His mom would be a parent in our family resource center. So, you know, listening to the needs and seeing what the community needs are, we wanted to make sure that we tackled every barrier. moment I walked in here it's felt like family you know and I see that on all you guys shirts and that's so important LeBron is an idol of mine and it's an honor it really is it's an honor and to the men and women standing on the outside you guys I'm telling take a bow for real because this is something that I know a lot of kids around the world need. I see you guys got your promises around the school. There's different promises for you know, the kids, for the staff, for the families. You know, and today I want to make a promise to you guys to extend myself in any way that I can to be here as long as I'm here in Cleveland and beyond. One, two, three. Family! I promise. I promise to go to school. To go to school. To do all of my homework. To do all of my homework. To listen to my teachers because they will help me learn. To listen to my teachers because they will help me learn. Thank you. Thank you, guys. He's coming back to help organize the happy, happy room. <laughs> To have fun. To have fun. And above all else. And above all else. Finish school. To finish school. Brown, like being like, like my idol. Honestly, just like this is a huge like step. He's always been in the community. He's always done things, but like to give back in this way. I know, just as an athlete and you know, as a person, just period. You know, what I mean, this is, this is great. This is phenomenal.